All right, so this is a differential out of what? I don't know. But this is a common problem. We have a transmission shop local and we'll do a lot of these for him. These pins are notorious for falling out or getting loose or something. So I'm gonna go ahead and weld around each one. And I'll show you it when it's done. All right, so this is what it looks like. Welded those little guys in there. Look at that, I think I've done that before. So somebody asked us on a YouTube channel, who is the better welder, me or George? It's the one who was welding at the time. All right, so he just called and said, can you weld the other side too? Which I said, yes, we can. So do you recognize this car, anybody? This is the 2018 Camaro 1LE. It's the one that went to the track with us. And of course, it's the one that destroyed my other camera. So we should call it the uh, camera killer. <laughs> Camaro camera killer. So basically we're gonna do a baseline dyno. There's George. It's all strapped on. It's already set. It's a beautiful 94 degrees. So right now is the car stock. Anything else done? No secrets? No special intake? I got some lug nuts on there. Lug nuts? Yeah. Yeah, maybe a couple of horsepower. So let's get a baseline run and then we can see where we are because this car will be getting some modifications, possibly an exhaust, an X-pipe once the exhaust is released. This is the one we did the X-pipe on that didn't fit. <laughs> so what's going on with that? Give us an update on the X-pipe. The uh, X-Pipe is here as it was last time, but the, uh, the exhaust is still being built by Borla and it should be back, uh, or it should be at my house probably in the next week. Okay, future future mods. So that will be coming up. Let's go ahead and run our fan. And let's go. Five fifty five and five forty four torque. Only a couple of horsepower between the runs, pretty much replicated it, and it's still sitting kinda hot over here. Ninety-five degrees. Again completely stock 2018 Camaro ZL11 LE. Okay, so we are gonna semi-retire the Honda pressure washer. This thing has done us pretty well, but it is a pain in the butt. Every time we want to wash something, drag this thing out, hook it up, hook that up, put go-go juice in there, all that good stuff. And it's just becoming a little bit tedious. Somebody just mentioned it on YouTube and I responded. Well, I called Matt at Obsessed Garage and ordered his, his cleaning kit. I'm getting the pump, the shelf, the hose reel, and the, uh, the small, spray trigger so basically going with Matt's recommendations he's obviously he's obsessed that's his name so the fact that he's put a whole kit together and he's happy with it and he's happy enough to sell it that's kind of a it's almost like a pre-test it's he's done the R&D and if it's good enough for him it's gonna be good enough for me so I just spoke to him ordered that he's gonna put something together and send it our way and what I'm gonna do is put it Near the door, we have a little area there that we've been piling parts up and it's waiting for customers to pick up. But I'm gonna put it near the end of the door, or the beginning of the door at least, and then plumb PVC water to it so it's always got a, a feed. And that way, when we need it, we just drag the hose out, squeeze it, and you've seen his videos. If not, I'll put a link. Gallons per minute is, uh, is, a, is a modification that I asked Krenzel to make. You gotta watch this, the, the stuff that he does, and that cleaning system, it's fantastic. I've just been getting to a point where I go, okay, let's do it. The system we have, again, it's just becoming tedious, and it's time consuming. When we drag a car out, we wanna wash it. Sometimes we're just rinsing off wheels or washing the car. Yeah, it's a 20, 30 minute mess around between putting it together, taking it back, rolling it back in the shop. It sits and we're trying to get stuff out of here, not bring stuff in. So that's just going to get repurposed. And of course, when we want to wash our own cars, if 
we need to do it just makes life much much easier so what I'll do I'll do a unboxing or however he packs it I'll just show you what you're gonna get and kind of lay it out and then we'll put it together and we'll maybe make an episode on it so if you haven't seen it go to his channel and you'll see him demonstrate it kind of show you my truck a little bit and I'm not showing you it because I just cleaned it and made it look all pretty it's been raining every day as you see by the ground it poured with rain on my way in again and I think it's rained every day for probably two weeks so this hasn't had a wash I mean I'm you know I hate to see it dirty but when it rains every day you're sometimes washing it in the rain which I do that by the way so I wanted to show you how well the paint looks even after monsoons and thunderstorms and dirt off the road if you get close you can kind of see you know the road film building up but my point being if you want to arrange to have us do your paint correction while your car is here and of course ceramic coat that is something we can offer and if it makes the whole process easier for you to bring the car to us and have everything done all at one time that is fine by us I'd like to do everything for you make you happy and also give you a finished product so definitely worth it again color correction is polishing the paint taking all the swirls out and all the marks and then the ceramic coat is like wax times 10 it seals the paint protects the paint it doesn't make it scratch resistant but it does make it a little bit more uh, impervious to dirt um, I'm not gonna rub this here but this is like pollen that's dripped on it it makes cleaning the vehicle much easier and in most cases just a rainstorm will clean the car or truck and as you see it's poured again it was pouring rain on my way in it just stopped we've got blue sky here and then another gray cloud so that'll probably be a rainstorm in about half an hour that's part of Florida extreme heat extreme rain but hey we still love it so keep that in mind it's something we can do for you if it's something you want to do get a hold of us ahead of time we need to make arrangements to have it done we need one full day to have it taken care of for you I told you it was gonna rain it's probably gonna do this for about another 25 minutes too see the paint how it beats So hopefully that just brings you up to speed and lets you know what we're doing. I'm edited in the video right now behind me. You see the pressure washing system I did order from Matt. The only thing I didn't order was the filter system because I don't really think I need that. We don't do a lot of high-end car washing here. It's basically washed, getting prepped, ready for something else. Uh, keep us in mind if you want to do the paint correction and ceramic coat. That's something we can arrange while the car is here. And also keep an eye out on that one LE Camaro. Uh, that will begin some mods in the future and we'll be putting it back on the dyno so thanks for watching thanks for stopping by subscribe click the bell clicking the bell by the way all it does is let you know when we put a video up we don't spam you or send you any junk or email you and try and uh, get you to subscribe to something else that's all it does so just keep that in mind i'm john from lsg performance back to work